Hello, Salam uh, Alaikum, hello my students in uh, grade 7, welcome back to our lessons on ICT subject. This is lesson 6, our 6th class today. Inshallah we are going to continue about the pair fails and the computer components or parts. Our <coughs> lesson today is about storage devices. These devices are used to store and save our information and files. Okay, first our lesson topics we are going to do uh, what are we going to do now? We are going to know and have some example of storage devices media. That means we are going to know some devices, names, capacities and some informations about them. First of all, let's start with the definition of storage device. Storage devices used to store information inside computer or external devices. If you want to save or store information inside computer, that means you are going to to use the hard disk. External devices like the CDs, DVDs, Blu-rays, flash computer, uh, flash disk, and so on. Storage capacity and reading writing speed is the main features to classify the storage devices to know the ability of your storage devices you have to know the capacity and then you can know the reading or writing speed the most common device or the best storage device is your hard disk because it's the bigger one and the fastest one for reading or writing <coughs> and then the rest of the devices you have the blu-ray we have the DVD we have the flash and so on sorry devices when you store data inside your computer sometimes you need to measure the capacity to measure the capacity we have a, a measurement storage unit for that this measurement unit is called byte and for byte when we collect 1000 byte we are going to get a kilobyte so the kilobytes equal 1024 bytes so the kilobyte is bigger than the byte okay now for the kilobyte if you collect 1000 kilobyte you are going to have a new unit which is called mega byte that means megabyte is bigger than the kilobyte megabyte equal 1024 kilobyte and you know the revolution of uh, technology uh, the capacity increases so now the megabyte if you collect 1000 megabyte you will have a new measurement unit which is called gigabyte. One gigabyte equal 1024 uh, megabyte. That means the gigabyte is bigger than the megabyte. And finally, the recent days now, we have a bigger unit than the gigabyte. If you collect 1000 gigabyte, you are going to have a new measurement unit, which is the biggest one now. It's called terabyte. 1 terabyte equal 1024 gigabyte and so on so the smallest measurement unit for storing it's called byte and the biggest one till now it's called terabyte <coughs> okay now on uh, the second on the coming slides we are going to have some examples for devices or for storing devices we have five devices hard disk drive CD rewritable drive DVD rewritable Blu-ray drive and finally memory card or USB flash first let's start with the hard disk our hard disk this is the picture of or the shape of hard disk it's an storage device it's the main storage device of the computer why because it's inside your computer they are very fast at transferring data because of that it's the best device to store your data there are two categories or types to store data inside your computer you have either internal 
storing or external storing internal storing means it's fixed why because it will be on the hard disk on your computer the second category or type it's external that means it's portable that means you can move the disk from device to another device like the DVD and CD the second device is called CD RW drive that means rewritable this is the device and this is the disk you see CD RW or rewritable okay CD stands for compact disk it's using laser technique or technology to read and write data it can store only 700 megabyte we have the driver this one it's called CD writable uh, rewritable why because you can write or copy some data in this CD okay this CD writable can read data can write data and erase the data from the disk itself and remember to write data on this CD you have to use the CD rewritable to read only or to record only we have to use another device this device is called CDR which refers to recordable CD recordable this can write data but cannot erase erased it again that means you are going to save on the CD once time or for once if you use the CD reco uh, recordable or R that means you are only going to write the data for once for only one time and then you cannot erase it if you want to use the disk this disk to copy some data to write some data on it and then to erase it that means you are going to use the CD rewritable okay if I ask you to differentiate between the CD rewritable and CD recordable CD rewritable can write data and erase it from the disk CD recordable you can see from the name recordable that means it will only write data the data but it will not erase the data CD <coughs> recordable drive used to read data from the CD like this okay the next device is the DVD rewritable it's uh, DVD stands for digital versatile disk or rewritable disk that you can see the shape the most common device which involves the DVD is the laptops this is the disk and this is the drive the data on the DVD writable disk on this disk can be erased and recorded many times on this disk without damaging the media why because it's very easier best technique and very big size so the DVD can be uh, can uh, we can write on it and we can read or erase the data and reuse it again the next device this is an improvement or development of the DVD it's like the DVD blu-ray drive it's like the DVD but it's bigger on the size the blu-ray can hold data more than can be stored than on a DVD it can hold more than 50 gigs or 50 gigabyte you can see the blu-ray it's like the DVD you can write data you can erase data and you can write again erase again and so on without damaging the disk but the size is very big than the DVD okay finally we have the memory card you see this is the shape of the memory card or USB flash they are very small you can see but can they can hold a lot of data memory cards are used in digital cameras video cameras and smartphones they are very small the memory cards but these are USBs or flashes USB flash is used in computer and laptops you see this is the shape of a USB flash and how to connect it 
the memory card it's available on smartphone video uh, cameras and digital cameras okay that's all about the story media today our lesson is finished see you next class or lesson inshallah until that time assalamu alaikum and be safe